Sine of 4x is a composite function, so to find its derivative, we will have to use the chain rule, which I've written here for your reference. The derivative of f of g is f prime of g times g prime. In our case, with sine of 4x, f of x, the outside function, is the sine function. And then, of course, g of x, the inside function, is 4x. Having identified that, applying the chain rule is straightforward. So, the derivative of sine of 4x is f prime of g. That's the derivative of the outside function, the derivative of sine, which is cosine, leaving the inside function, g of x, which in this case is 4x, unchanged. But then we multiply by g prime, the derivative of the inside function. The derivative of 4x is just 4, so that is our derivative, which we may prefer to write like this, 4 times cosine of 4x. Taking the derivative of composite functions with sine is straightforward. In general, it looks like this. The derivative of sine of a function u is cosine of u times the derivative of u with respect to x, just like we saw here. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions, and be sure to check out my calculation. Calculus One course and Calculus One exercises playlists in the description for more. Thanks for watching.